Hi everyone, uh, welcome to my channel. I'm Sanapa. Okay, so in this video you will see a temperature controller. Okay, uh, what is temperature controller? How it is working? Uh, what is the use of this temperature controller with probe? Okay, so what type of uh, temperature sensor is used in for this uh, temperature controller? Okay. So before that, we will see what is temperature controller. Okay, so it's a controller which will monitor the temperatures. Okay, temperature of the equipment or where we need to cool or heat the uh, equipment. Okay, so this will monitor uh, through a uh, temperature sensor or temperature probe. Okay, so this will receive a signal from uh, from or through the temperature sensor. It will react based on the settings value. Okay, so this is temperature controller. Okay. So the temperature controller will monitor the temperature range or temperature value through the uh, sensor which is connected with this controller. So on the temperature controller we can set the uh, set point like uh, what, what temperature range it should on and what temperature range it should off. Okay. So based on that this uh, temperature controller will um, uh, switch on and switch up the load uh, which is connected with this controller. Okay. So basically, uh, uh, there are uh, two types of temperature controllers. Okay, so one is for cooling, one is for heating. Okay, so the philosophy, the concept is same uh, for both, but the different is the temperature value. For cooling, the temperature range will, will be um, from minus 50 or minus uh, 32, um, maximum 30 degrees Celsius or 50 degrees Celsius. Okay. For heating purpose, it depends upon the material, the what uh, range we have to heat, uh, like more than 100 or 500, some uh, equipment we need to heat uh, more than 1000 also, okay. Here we have one small uh, temperature control panel, okay. So this uh, temperature controller is Dixel make, it is a basic model of the temperature controller. So with this, we have one uh, DVL starter to start stop the uh cooling equipment okay so this type of controller is used to uh used for the cooling purpose okay so with this controller we have one uh ntc type uh temperature probe okay temperature sensor ntc type okay so we will see how it is working okay now we put a switch on this controller so this started now you can see the current temperature value is 28.7 okay you can see the set value 6 okay so the uh, set value is 6 degree uh, celsius uh, the current value is 29.3 okay now you can see the load is on okay that means uh, the starter is on the power is going to the cooling equipment the equipment it is started the cooling the area okay so this temperature will be sensed through this um, ntc type probe okay so you can see this is uh, probe uh, sensor end okay here the temperature is sensing as you see if i rub this due to heat the temperature is increasing okay So I, I told you this controller is for cooling purpose. So once the uh, equipment is started cooling, the temperature should uh, go down below the six. Okay. If the temperature is uh, goes below the six, because six is the set value, the controller will stop the load. That means the cooling will be stopped. Okay. Once the uh, temperature is uh, crossing six uh, degrees Celsius, again the controller will start and it will uh, start to cooling the equipment okay so this is the purpose uh, we are using this controller this is the working logic for this controller okay so this controller this is a uh, dixel made as i told you this is connected with ntc type probe okay so this is a very user friendly controller okay you can uh, see the ambient temperature like uh, what is current temperature uh, in this display 
you can uh, uh, by pressing this uh, set key you can check the set value okay if you want to change the um, set value uh, press uh, set key two second till it's billings okay now this is uh, edit mode you can adjust the temperature okay now our set value is 36 so our current value is 29 that means our set value is reached okay that, so the load is off okay now you can see if you set set value below the current value then the this will on automatically okay now it started so this is how uh, the this temperature control is controlling the cooling cooling equipment okay so this is ntc type probe okay so this probe ntc means negative temperature coefficient okay that means uh, there are two types of uh, temperature probes available one is ntc one is ptc okay ntc means negative temperature coefficient um, PTC means positive temperature coefficient okay negative temperature coefficient means when this temperature increase uh, this resistance value will decrease okay when this uh, temperature value decrease the resistive value is increase but in PTC type uh, it, it will reverse vice versa it means it will work vice versa when the temperature increase the resistance value also increase when the temperature decrease the resistance value also decrease okay in cooling equipment most of this controller is supporting with ntc probe okay this NT ntc probe is uh, used widely in uh, cooling purpose okay so now we'll see this controller part okay this controller is working with a 230 volt ac supply okay see you can see uh, control supply is 230 volt ac and we have one uh, common and no nc okay one in uh, it's a drive uh, dry uh, dry contact volt free contact and we have two probe optional okay one is uh, as i told you probe probe input another one is digital input so it's default coming with probe input option if you want to change digital input you have to do the settings in the controller okay so basically the panel will be uh, installed somewhere near the uh, operator or near the person where we can access easily okay and the probe okay this probe will be installed uh, in the cooling equipment or the cooling unit or the cooling material okay where we need to monitor or control the cooling equipment okay so this sensor will be connected with this panel okay so this sensor will be installed somewhere and this uh, panel will be installed somewhere this will be connected with the wire okay so with this wire connection the controller will monitor the temperature okay or it will sense the temperature through this sensor okay so this controller has option for cooling and heating okay so both it, it has option for uh, both cooling and heating okay so if you see the manual you can see ch kind of action okay cl cooling ht heating okay so i hope you understood whatever i explained you so far okay so this will be uh, useful for you in your future projects okay mm. if you are new for my channel please do subscribe okay and also check my uh, video playlist okay there are uh, many different topics uh, you i updated many videos okay uh, please check it out and uh, <clears throat> subscribe okay subscribe the channel and i will meet you in next video with a different subject till then bye from senapparajan